Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for October 19th of 2022 well, it is titled A Galaxy Beyond Stars, Gas, and Dust. So what do we see here? Well, here we see a galaxy off in the distance, and that is the spiral galaxy known by its catalog designation, NGC 7497. And it is a spiral galaxy, and here it's all tied up in these tendrils of dust, which have nothing to do with the galaxy itself. The dust is actually within our own Milky Way and is a part of our galaxy. The gal other galaxy on the on, by comparison is actually nearly 60 million light years away. So way beyond the edge of our own galaxy. Now this is a interesting image in that it is taken to try to simulate what the eye would be able to see if it could pick up this much detail if it could see enough detail to be able to view this. So it uses the similar filters the red green and blue filters just like our eyes do in tier inside to be able to pick out the images so it's essentially a true color image of what things would look like and that's very difficult to get often in astronomy because we all have to use filters to be able to collect light and gather things. So many images that we look at are not fake, but they are not true color images as to how things would necessarily appear to the eye. However, of course, our eye could not collect enough light to be able to see an image that would be this faint. It has to collect light this time for 19 hours of exposure was done in order to see this image. So this is 19 hours worth of collecting light, whereas our eyes collect light for just a fraction of a second before sending that information on to our brain. If somehow our eyes could collect it for hours, we might see something similar to what we see here today. Now as you look around, you can see some other galaxies here off to the left hand side and as well to the right. Anything that does not have those diffraction spikes for star that are stars going through it. So those diffraction spikes caused by the optics of the telescope appear on point sources of light like stars but do not appear on galaxies. So we can see a number of galaxies scattered around the image here. And we can also see that the stars have different colors that we see a very distinct coloring of the stars, some of them with a bluish tinge and some with the red. And that is telling us about the temperatures of the stars. The hotter a star is, the shorter the wavelength it will emit on average and the closer it will be toward the blue end of the spectrum. So a blue star is a very hot star, whereas a very cool star will emit longer wavelength light and primarily appear toward the red end of the spectrum. So just by looking at the colors of the stars in this image, we can get an idea of which of them are the hotter stars and which are cooler. So that was our picture of the day for October 19th of 2022. It was titled A Galaxy Beyond Stars Gassed Dust. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.